13 News, Kansas News Leader. Topeka West High School theater students are gearing up for a fun fall family fundraiser and their next production at the same time. Grace Everett is director of the upcoming show. They promised her the moon. Shelby Sanders plays the lead in that show, and they both are involved in the troupe of the International Thespian Society. President and Vice President, right? Yes. yes. You all are busy, busy young ladies. Definitely. So let's talk about the show first, Grace, since you are the director. What is the show about? Um, the show follows Jerry Cobb, who is the first woman to go through space flight testing. Ah. Um, she was a part of a program called the Mercury 13 that was tested alongside the Mercury 7 and um, our, their plan was to get women up into space but it never actually got to go through. So is this like drama, comedy? It's a drama definitely. Musical? You sing songs? No. <laughs> <laughs> but it's a drama. What did you do? So you play Jerry. Yes. And so Shelby, how much research did you do or what did you in particular want to do to make sure that you're going to be doing this role the best way you can? Um, honestly, I've been researching the show since it was last announced. Ah. Um, I personally am like a huge space nerd, so um, I was very excited when the show got announced. And I think researching Jerry Cobb and those peers that she interacted with, who are also real char characters in the show, was very important for me to understand how to interact with my peers who are playing those characters, and for me to really be able to do her justice in a way. Yes, and show. give me give me a sales pitch for this because some people might think like, oh, this is a biography, therefore it must not be very exciting or interesting to watch unfold. What's been surprising to the two of you as you've been watching this show come to life? Um, there's definitely a lot more that goes into this story than I thought there was initially. Um, the whole first act, she's in a sensory deprivation chamber where um, kind of all of her backstory floats in and out throughout. Oh um, while she's also breaking this record for, she was in the tank for over nine hours, which I don't think any of the men made it past four when they were doing it. Go girl, right? Mm -hmm. <laughs> I mean, it's like girl power there. So, so this is all very dramatic unfolding on stage. So let's like switch gears and talk about something fun because you all have something super fun planned to gain support to be able to do things like that. And that is the fall fun day? Yes. What's happening there and what is that all about? Uh, so it's happening October 26th uh, from 2 to 3 in the front parking lot of Topeka West High School. Um, it's just going to be a ton of games and crafts um, and it kind of acts as a fundraiser for us but we also want to reach out to the community um, and just have a fun event. Uh, we had it last year, but I don't think we got the word out enough, so hopefully we get the word out enough this year. I think and it was kind of chilly or something that day, too. Yeah. So this is ideal for kids ages 5 to 10. Yes. Um, $10 per child because it, it works out to a dollar a ticket uh, for the activities. What are the types of activities that they can do just to come out and have fun? Um, we have face painting, a ton of fun carnival games, as well as a lot of crafts. So a lot of fun for the kids. How is this going to support all of you in your efforts in Topeka West Theater? Um, hopefully we can raise enough money um, to start building a ITF savings pod. Um, it is typically around $1,000 to go to ITF, um, International Thespian Festival. Festival. Um, and that happens next summer. And first you go to KTF uh, in January. And we have 23 people, I believe, going this year and competing. So, so this will support those efforts. Yes. And more than anything, you just want people to come out and have fun, yes. get to know you all, interact, and they they do a great job. We saw some of the video last year, and you had all the activities there, and super fun for kids. Five to ten is who they target, but they really want your whole family to come out and have a great fun day. The fall fun day for the Topeka West High School theater students, two to five p.m. on Saturday, October 25th. Again, ten dollars for child that gets ten tickets, and then you can get some additional tickets for activities. And then be sure you catch them on stage in They Promised Her the Moon, a fantastic show November 14th to 16th, all taking place right at the high school. Shelby and Grace, thank you both for being here. Appreciate it and look forward to seeing all you have to do. We are going to